bad. You too. What going on? It's your boy Nate. I know it's been long overdue. Y'all been telling me like, when you gonna do YouTube? When you gonna start YouTube? All oh, this and that. I'm finna start right now. And this is what I'm bringing to y'all, but look, come here. Go up on that. Y'all know what that is. Y'all know what that is right here. But look, look. What did bad say? Oh, y'all might think this is like a, a third gen, but no, it's a, it's a second gen. Right to the back. You see that? It's a second gen. And look at that interior. Look inside it. We're completely gutted, bro. We finna swap everything from this car to this car. Cause this car is completely totaled, bro. 11 to 14 Hellcat swap. Today, when we gonna drop the engine out of here, get it ready to go inside the engine. And fit get check, the bro. Fit check real quick. Fit Let check, me get a fit, fit check, check, bro. Hey, don't bet me in the comment, bro. <laughs> no, no, but we still told by the way. You know, it's a little chilly, bro. But we finna drop the cat, the big cat out of here. You feel me? 717. Uh, hit me up on my Instagram at who.n and the number eight. If y'all want to do a build like this, you know, I know people want like a Carson 300 Hellcat build, a Scat Pack build. Like, I do all that, bro. I've been doing this for like four years now. I'm just now sharing it with y'all, basically. YouTube, what's going on? It's the next day, man. And like, from what y'all seen last time, it's totally different now. Like, we got the exhaust out. We had to cut it out from the back because it was all bent up. We got the engine, the drive shaft, all that's gonna go up today. But I still gotta get the rear end out from this from this car. Drop the rear end and gas tank out of here, so we can put the rear end and gas tank from out of this one. I'm gonna get back to y'all on that. Hey man, it's been a few days from that last clip I had, but I'm finna show y'all what's going on with the car, man. Look. Damn. Engine in, suspension up, rear end in, drive shaft up, exhaust up. I don't know if y'all can see, but so we getting up, bro. Until you're not in yet, we're going to do that last. But yeah, that's just a little update for right now. I'm going to show y'all once we get it down on the ground and put the cooling system and stuff back in. Ooh, that boy's sitting up. Jeez. Ooh, that boy's sitting Check this out, bro. Down on the ground, man. It's a little hot because it got wide body suspension on it. So that's why I got a gap like that. We're going to put lower springs on it. Look at the SRT behind, behind the fire spot. That's a hard. But yeah, we almost done, bro. We still gotta do interior. You know, I told y'all we were gonna do interior last. You know. But interior, then we gotta put the radiator and condenser and stuff back on. And we almost done, no cap. I'm gonna record a little snippet, put a little footage and stuff like that. And we're getting the interior taken out. Finna put in the red seats and the red door panels. And up here, we put the fan. The fan right there, the condenser and stuff up. But we got to get them a new fan because I don't know if y'all can see. Like, each blade is cracked. I know y'all can see that one right there. But, like, each blade is cracked, so we got to order a new one for them and then put them on there. That's just a little update for right now. I'm going to show y'all once I get the seats and stuff in. It's going to look crazy, but red on red, too hard. No cap. I'm already halfway done taking the dope panels off. We did that side already. Got my little sister in here working, too. You see what I'm saying? We all get to work in. I'm almost done, bro. With the black interior. Hey, I'm thinking about putting these in my car too. What y'all boy think? Like, my car right there, I had to take my drive shaft out. Cause you know I make it too much power. But yeah, so I'm thinking about putting these panels in there. The suede and uh, leather. That's gonna be hard. The seats too. That's gonna be hard. Y'all boy let me know though. We got the panels out, out with the old. 
and with the new man that's what he going with red on red but it's gonna be crazy seats and everything but they're a little dirty but we're gonna clean them up once we put them up you know give them a full little detail or take it to one of these little places i know get a detail it's gonna be one on one hardest in atlanta i'm telling you big cat bro we almost done i'm gonna keep y'all boy posted you already know oh, no, i'm in there man it's a little dirty but it's gonna be a hike for right now it'd be like a batmobile all right so, so we got all the rest of the pieces in we got the fan in we got the airbag lawn springs we finna do all that today we finna put the interior in here go the seats big cat big cat you know what i'm saying got little briar yo big lad we in the back of that cat interior in see what i'm saying gotta take that airbag up hell on up we still gotta put the handle up on that side oh you know all right so for that last clip we did the interior we finished it up fully you know i changed that airbag see what i'm saying everything up handle everything up but now this is what we doing now boom putting the lower springs on that out with the old and with the new i put one up already we still gotta do the back the back way easier the front the hardest part you know you get the hardest part done first that's the back ones um but yeah, I can't wait to drop this joint. One of Wayne. This is a 392 edition car. 392 was only made for 2014 model year. This is number 335 out of 392. I gotta find his emblem that was right here. I gotta find his badge. I'm gonna give it to him when we completely finish. But yeah, that's just a little update. I'm gonna show y'all the car when it's lowered. Oh my goodness, bro. This is the next day. Lowering springs on. This thing look amazing, bro. I got her next to my baby, man. I'm going to get them slowing springs. I ain't going to cap. I got to get them because, bro, that fitment is perfect, bro. That fitment is perfect. I mean, I'm not sitting up high, but that fitment right there is crazy. And one more thing. Let me know if I should just get an SRT8 front end because this don't look crazy, bro. This is what I got. This is the front end I got, you know, the newer front end. I did a front end conversion for a full conversion. You know, I'm gonna show y'all this a little more about this on another video, but this is the main focus right now. Yeah, bro. It's crazy. Almost done. No cap. No cap. We gotta change the oil cooler because the other, like the brackets. The brackets was, was broke off. These two brackets right here that was broke off from the accident. So we gotta take the bumper back off. We just put it on just to see what it was looking like, you know? And this thing looked hard, but I'm telling you. You wouldn't even know it's a cat in there. It still said 392. He said he's keeping the badges and everything. But yeah, we finna swap this out. And today, we might crank it up today. Keep y'all posted. Just put the new oil cooler up. It's not fully buttoned up yet, but it's just a little markup for right now. Yeah, man. But when the cat is done, the oil cooler put in. I got the key right here. I'm finna crank it up for y'all, boy. Woo! -hoo. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. I'm just doing a crank up just for y'all to see, you know? Only 14k miles on her, too. Basically brand new for real, for real. But yeah, I'm gonna crank it up. Next video, gonna be a POV drive. Come on, now. I know y'all can't wait for that one. I know y'all can't wait for that one. Hold on, though. Crack that bad boy up. Ooh! Yeah! I don't got no tire press sensors. I gotta see why the check engine light on. The e brakes on. Take the e brake off. You see what I'm saying? Big cat. We're gonna do a POV drive. Y'all want a night POV or a daytime POV? Matter of fact, I'm gonna just do both. I'm gonna just do both. Yeah, that's the end of the vlog. I'm gonna catch y'all in this one.